Hello there everyone and welcome back to Pokemon Emerald Type Chain Challenge. It has been a long time since I've uh, done any videos at all actually. So we're jumping back into the Emerald Type Chain Challenge as our first video back. So let me just explain what the premise is again. Uh, in Type Chain, Type Chain Challenge, your team can only consist of Pokemon that create a a chain based on their types. So, for example, we have Wolrain, who is ice water, Milotic, that is water, Garpedo, that is water dark, Absol, that is dark, Houndoom, that is dark fire, and Typhlosion, who is fire. So, all, all the types create a chain, and if a Pokemon uh, was to be moved around like this, then the chain would be broken as Milotic is not a dark type, so we can't use any of the Pokemon that followed Darpedo. So luckily we have a full chain and we'll be able to continue. So we're going to be uh, mostly avoiding trainers, I'm going to be doing some grinding off uh, video. I never did any. I'm pretty sure I said I was going to do some, but life happened and then we didn't do it. So it's fine. So our Wolverine is currently our big main Pokemon uh, as it has Ice Ball, and Ice Ball is very powerful. Especially uh, with Wolverine at a low level, at level 29. Let's avoid you. We'll be avoiding most of the trainers. And I do want to try and avoid Pokemon Battles, but it's fine. Uh, we're going to be taking on Team Aqua today. As they have taken over the Weber Institute and well they need to be stopped. So we'll be doing that. So let's head on over. Uh and try and avoid these battles as much as possible. We can actually run from these battles. Okay, I hate the rain animation, so run. Uh, avoid you, there we go. You can avoid every train on this route, it is wonderful. But let's quickly heal up. And what I am going to do temporarily is put Typhlosion in the box. Because we've got the gift cast form that we can get, which I think is randomised, so we'll see what that is. But we've got a few battles to do, such as this Juggler Forest, who has Krabby. We shouldn't have too much of a problem. Good, it's paralysed. I can now start up the Ice Ball Chain. Vice Group's not going to do too much, that's fine. And of course we'll attack Miss, so the chain's gone. Okay, Ice Ball. Okay, you only had one Pokemon anyway, before you had more. Do we have an experience share? Yes we do, I'm going to give that to you. What do you have on you? Black glasses I think. You have never melt ice, you have black glasses, you have big speed shit, yeah, okay. Okay, you're next. Okay. 
Zubat, that'll go down quite quick. Also, I didn't see how many Pokemon they had. Okay, Zubat is down. Sentrap, you're gonna go down anyways, that's not an issue. There we go. Now let's head on upstairs. We've got a double battle here. We can't change our party around, so this is Wolverine and Milotic. As our start. Okay. That Zubat's gonna go down in hopefully one hit. And Iggly Buff. Could be an interesting one. It should go down. Confuse rate on the Milotic, that's fine. So if we use Water Pulse on Igly Buff again. Hopefully we're not hurt by the confusion. Good. Okay, so Igly Buff should be down now. V Bass will go down with the next Ice Ball. And assuming we're not uh, hit by confusion, the new Mel should go down as well. Wow, that V Bass survived. That's surprising. Okay, Water Pulse goes off. New Mel is down. We're going to attack on Milotic, that's fine. And Feebas is down. There we go. So now... Let's take on this one. I'm going to need to heal up after this battle. Sea Dot. Okay, so that's another Ice Ball. That's Water Gun, that was a wrong move, I pressed A too quick. There we go. You have three Pokemon. Two Glass types so far, so that Bulbasaur should in theory go down in one hit. Yep. What's the final Pokemon? Giggle it. It's faster. That's fine. And Diggle it's down. What I will quickly do actually is take that off you. Give that to you instead. And then... We need a heal. And now we'll take on you. Snubble. Okay. It has Intimidate. Hopefully it doesn't have Glare. Okay, we are faster than it, which is good. So we can't get uh, hit by flinch. Okay, and Porygon should go down in one hit. Okay, maybe not, but it's going to go down in the next hit. That's for sure. There we go.
And we got a flavor. Interesting. Okay, let's uh, head over to the PC. So Leyron is also has Mystic Water equipped, so it's a still rock type. Okay. Wasn't sure if it was rock still or still rock. It's fine. And put you back in here. Does somewhat in You have a lax incense, okay. I'll tell you what, actually, I won't bring you back into the party just yet. We're going to find out what's in this egg. Because it could be something good. We don't know. Uh, I do need to heal up, actually. So let's head over this way and we're actually going to end off this part here because we've got a, another big bow in as we step forward so till then thank you for watching hope you have enjoyed this episode it's a bit weird being back recording I don't feel like I've hit that natural spot again but we'll get there so thank you for watching hope you have enjoyed you have be sure to give it a like until the next one goodbye